today we are going to discuss about the next topic that is the morphology of the rbc's rbc's are about normal shape their their shape is described as disc shape or biconcave shape and this disc shape or biconcave shape of rbc's the reason why they are disc shape only they can be round shape or rod shape or any other shape but when rbc particularly because they have to carry oxygen and carbon dioxide and they have to pass through various capillaries without getting damaged they have a particularly a disc shape or biconcave shape the reason why these are disc shape or biconcave shape is that the cell membrane the cell membrane of the rbc's are having anchorin spectrin and actin molecules this spectrin molecule along with the anchorin molecule and actin molecule will pass through the entire rbc and it will give the disc shape or biconcave shape to the rbc cells so this rbc the disc shape of the rbc's or biconcave shape of the rbc's having various advantages of the for the rbc's the those are diffusion of oxygen the oxygen or carbon dioxide molecule can easily diffuse through the surface area and also the increase the surface area of the by the of the rbc's so that absorption of various nutrients or oxygen molecules will be more the the disc shape will provide more surface area for more absorption and also whenever the volume alters within the rbc's there will be minimal tension offered when it is of disc shape the last function and very important function is that the rbc they can squeeze through the capillaries for suppose the capillaries are only about 7 microns imagine if the capillaries are very minute or even less than 7 microns so for the rbc to pass through these capillaries and come out of that rbc come out of the capillaries is very difficult if any other round shape or any other rod shape or even larger size so in order to enable